So there's a new addition to our daddy kink group chat. Oh who is it who is it? Yeah yeah I wanna know. Come on big daddy don't be shy. Okay calm down let me add them. Yamaguchi added Bakuto. Hey hey hey. Bakuto. I mean I know I been manifesting that he'd be here but damn I didn't think it would work. Sheesh Bakuto's hella daddy material. Hell yeah I am. I'm fucking amazing. Might just have to hand over my big daddy title over to you. Wait you have the big daddy title. Hell yeah I do. Don't remember why but I got it and now I'm handing it over to you. So then what are we supposed to call you? Just plain daddy. Sooner I know good and god damn well you did not just disrespect the daddy title like that. No no no. It just needs a little extra spice. Then moan it. What? Wait send a voice message if you do. I agree. That's not my job. Are you disrespecting bigger daddy's orders? Oh. Uh, wait. Bigger daddy. My bad let me just. My apologies. Anyways. Sooner sent a voice message. Holy shit you actually did it. God damn that shit was hot. Got me feeling some type of way now. Maybe I like to be praised too. You have a sexy ass voice. Yeah. I like praise. Everyone is offline. 1.15am. I'm gonna fucking overdose on ice cream. You're lactose intolerant. Exactly. Okay before you shit yourself what happened? Did you try to kill Akashi again? Did he what? Okay first of all those were accidents. Why would I try to kill the hottest man I've ever been with? Didn't you date Atsumu too? He's really hot. Okay one yes he's really fucking hot and two we both used each other for sexual release. So why exactly are you trying to end up sleeping on the toilet? Because I almost fucking accidentally hurt Akashi again. You almost hurt him more than once. They were accidental he keeps popping up out of nowhere. But this time it was in the shower. Elaborate. So like. Akashi helps me shave cause I keep getting frustrated since I can't see under my dick. Then get hard. I'm hard all the time in the shower. Hello it's the one place I can think about Akashi without my boner getting noticed. What do you expect me to do with this information? Anyways that's besides the point. I fucking slipped and bumped into Akashi and he dropped the fucking electrical razor on himself. I wanted to fucking cry. Why do you have electricity in the shower? No it's one of those electrical razors that can be in water. Oh you mean one of those brawn shavers? Yeah yeah. I don't think those razors can cut you. I mean it's designed to not cut your skin so I mean. Oh. Uh, then never mind my baby's fine. Dumb bitch. Suck my dick. Everyone is offline. 2.40 AM. Bro in a sleep talks and he says the weirdest shit. Do tell. Like he just said bro shut the fuck up and let me watch Demon Slayer and eat peanut butter. You fucking peanut butter. What the fuck did you just say? How could you not like peanut butter? I'm allergic to peanuts. Then just don't be allergic. Well I should have thought of that. BRB let me just go eat a jar full of peanut butter. Exactly. Shut up go eat some ice cream. Why thank you for the invitation. I'll just end up shitting myself if I do. Yeah and I'll end up fucking dying if I eat peanut butter. Just have your EP pen near you. Bitch I'll be near death how the fuck you expect me to have enough consciousness to grab an EP pen. Well shit I don't see you coming up with ideas. How about not eating peanut butter? Damn I didn't think about that one. That was a really clever idea. I will kill every single one of you. Everyone is offline. 4.17am. Bakuto is calling. Three people joined the call. Okay I have questions for you guys. Ask away. What's your favorite color? Yellow. Purple. Blue. Okay say top. They said top. Say it three times fast. They said it three times fast. Spell it. They spelled it. Bakuto what are you doing? Shut up this is the last question. What do you do at a green light? They said stop and Bakuto laughed. It took them a minute to realize why he was laughing in the three side and or face palmed. There's no fucking way you got me with that shit. The light turns green oh let me just stop in the middle of moving traffic to fix my makeup. Karen calls the police these people were all moving at a green light when they should have been stopping. Police just hangs up on her. The four were all laughing uncontrollably at their stupidity. 
That was all I wanted. All right later. Call ended. 6.30 a.m. Bro I am so whipped. We know. What happened this time? They were literally just. Talking. They have hot ass voices so I get your point. No no. But also yes. But not what I meant. Then what did you mean? Like knowing they used to hate each other and now they are being all lovey. It makes my heart go all you woo. Okay first of all. Never fucking say you woo again. Second. I live for your relationship. Like Bokuro show. In Bokuro show we trust. Amen. Like you really living a Wattpad fanfic. Got that enemies to lovers and childhood sweethearts with Daisho and Kuro. Then got the best friends to lovers with you and Kuro. Like goddamn share some of that ideal relationship. Exactly like spare some for the poor. Nathams two's mine forever. Ain't gone catch me lacking when I bagged an amazing relationship. Everyone is offline. 8.40 AM. Wait I just thought about it. What? If you three were to get married, whose last name would you take? Oh yeah I never thought about that. Obviously they'd take mine. Does Tichisuro Bakuto and Sugiru Bakuto really sound right to you? Fuck yeah it does. Good because that has a surprisingly good ring to it. Okay but hear me out. Katero Daisho and Tichisuro Daisho. Stop I want them to have my last name don't make me have second thoughts. Just saying. Okay but Katero Kuro. Oh wait I really like that one. That one just glides right off the tongue. Don't make that sound fruity I know you bitches will. Deletes fruity message I was typing. But god damn it I really like Katero Kuro. I'm second guessing them taking my last name now. Have fun with your crisis. Everyone is offline. 1.35 PM. No because Noya just asked me out on a Walmart date and I cried. Excuse me what's wrong with Walmart? No I fucking love Walmart. It's just the way he did it. And how did he do it? What should be like the dumbest thing? Asking you to shut the fuck up. Disrespectfully. Anyways. He came out of nowhere and sat on my lap. Kinky. I know but not the point. And he said Yuji will you go out on the most loveliest and romantically epic Walmart date we've ever been on. Sounded like a proposal. Which is why I cried. Wait what exactly is a Walmart date? We purposely try to get kicked out of multiple Walmarts without getting banned. Wait a second. Was that time you guys fucked in an aisle one of your Walmart dates? No we were actually trying to shop that time. You fucked in a Walmart aisle. Yes it was one of the few times I got turned on in public. Do tell one of the other times. So we were at the mall. Oh lord. And Noya likes to walk in front of me which I find really adorable. I can smell where this is going. And like you know how you'll subconsciously look at the ground when you're walking. Called it. Yeah I accidentally look at his ass sometimes. Define accidentally. Volleyball ass. Or shit how do you survive? I don't. How big is it though? Like you just got a stare. God damn how is he surviving? Cause he has me. And how are you just barely surviving? It's called a jacket and having enough self control until we get home. I would die on the spot ain't no way you surviving. Akashi has a volleyball ass too don't he? Like a motherfucker.